Hello YouTube, welcome to the review by me, John. Today I'm going to be reviewing this frozen pizza by DiGiorno. As you can see, it is new. This is the crispy pan pizza from DiGiorno. And I have the pepperoni variety. It also comes in cheese and there might be a supreme. I only saw cheese and pepperoni when I was at the store. But I think there's a third one, if I'm not mistaken. But anyway, this crispy pan pizza is sometimes what's known as Detroit style. If you are familiar with Little Caesars Pizzeria, their deep, deep dish pizza is also Detroit style. Also, Jet's Pizza has a uh, Detroit style deep dish. So DiGiorno is trying to make their own at home frozen variety. And I'm going to see how it is. Um, before I try it out, I'm just going to let you know a little bit how it's cooked. So it comes in this rectangular box. In the box, the pizza comes in this lasagna looking tray. You cook it for, at 400 degrees for 22 to 24 minutes inside of the tray. So you put the tray right into the oven. Um, it's, I guess it's safe enough. It worked for me, nothing caught on fire. And after 22 minutes, you take it out. You let it sit for a couple minutes before you cut into it, and then you eat it. Um, it also says to take it out of the tray before you cut it. That's why it's not currently in the tray. Just take it out of the tray, let it sit, then you cut it. So one of the good things about uh, Detroit style is if you see my pizza here, it is a rectangular shape, no middles, it's all edge pieces. The corner pieces are typically um, the best because the Detroit style, what you really want is really crisp edges or some like caramelized cheese on the edge. So I'm going to go ahead and give this piece a try. There's a couple pepperonis on it. There's some edge work. Let's give it a taste. So one thing you're going to notice in Detroit style is that there's the, the dough is pretty thick. And even though the dough is pretty thick, it's not dense. It's a little, it's a lighter dough. There's a lot of air in it. But the dough also has a nice like buttery flavor. I don't see if you can see on the bottom, but it's kind of like yellow and brown on the bottom. A lot of oils and butters and things that are terrible for you. So, I don't know, that end piece didn't have a lot of, oh this one has a lot. This one you can see right on the corner, some nice burnt cheese underneath it and that's what you want the the piece I had the first one I had had one one part of the edge that was really nicely crisp I did leave this in the oven for 24 minutes it said 22 to 24 maybe a little bit longer I could have gotten uh, a better crisp edge to it but uh, I did have some on mine, and the other pieces look like they're a little bit crispier than the one I had. But this pizza is really good. The edge, as you can see, nice golden brown underneath. There's a lot of like buttery goodness um, underneath it. Even though it's a lot of dough, it's not very dense. It's very airy. The flavor is pretty good. I'm going to give the DiGiorno's Crispy Pan Detroit style pizza a 9 out of 10. And typically I don't really uh, go for DiGiorno, I'm more of a home run in type of frozen pizza. But this one impressed me, I like it. Let me know if you guys have tried it, I think uh, not all stores carry it. Um, 
in the Chicago region, uh, only Jewel Osco was carrying it. So you might want to look at the DiGiorno website to find out where it's located for you. But anyways guys, I hope you like this video, and until next time, 